welcome back to a new video in today's video we're going to be doing a set of like pop art valentines i know this is probably like a little bit boring but i really enjoy doing pop art nails so i thought we'd just go for it i've got my madam glam gel polishes here you can get 30 percent off using my code natmug30 i'm going to be using rosy nude this is one of my favorites oh um i've got very berry which i don't actually end up using in the end lavender springs and pop the champagne so we're going to be using all of those apart from very berry i'm going to start by applying two coats of rosy nude to each of our nails um you're going to need two coats and each coat will need 30 second to cure in an led lamp and then i'm going to put a blob of each of the colors onto my palette and then we're going to start to draw on our french no well they are french nails but we're going to start to draw on our smile lines <laughs> so i draw the smile line bit with my detailer brush and i just fill in like the sides and just underneath a little bit and then I will grab the bottle, the brush from the bottle just to fill in the free edge because it's just a lot quicker. If you've got loads of product on your palette, you could do it with the, just to use that product up, you could do it with your, your brush. But it's a lot quicker to do it with the brush in the bottle. That will get cured. Then I'm going to do the same thing to another nail, but I like to just measure up the, the smile lines. So I'll just hold them next to each other just to make sure that the nail bed is the same distance from the cuticle as close as possible. Um, I'm going to do the set. I'm going to do another nail with this pink. So if you were going to do five nails, then I would do two pinks, but I'm only going to show you me doing one. I'm going to use the hearts and stars outlines from Nail Sugar. These are water decals. I'm going to use the hearts for this. I've cut out my heart. Not literally. That sounds awful. <laughs> cut around the excess and then I've put it upside down on a stamper and I'm just dampening the back with some water and then if you leave it for several seconds the backing will just peel off really easily and then I just dab the, the back just to make sure there's no like too much I don't want loads of excess water on it and then I'm going to stamp it onto this nail in the middle somewhere there we go Ta -da! and then we've already got our heart that's great. Um, I'm gonna velvet matte top coat them. I'm sorry, but we're going we're going matte because pop art nails. I feel they need to be matte, so I'm gonna matte all of them. Um, I've done it a little bit prematurely on the heart nail because we're gonna have to top coat that again. But you'll see what I mean in a minute. To do the details, we're gonna use Madame Glam's black and white gel paint. So with pop art nails you need to just basically you're going to draw, draw an outline on everything so our small lines are going to have an outline and then you also need to outline the edge of the, the nails so you just watch 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 you'll know what i mean because this video probably won't get many views because everyone's probably done this kind of thing i mean i've done it before but i didn't do the french style pop art nails um so i don't know the, yeah there we go look now i'm taking the black around the edge of the nail it j just makes it look like it's been drawn like a cartoon so i mean do they, would you call these pop art nails or would you call them cartoon nails you could call them either couldn't you either either so yeah all the way around the outside edge try and keep the line roughly the same thickness down one side as the other because otherwise you'll end up it'll look might look a bit funny <laughs> right when we've done that we're then going to add some little very fine detail lines so i i mean i don't really know what i'm doing here i'm just going to kind of go underneath this bit and then down this side and across a little bit like get, we get, get our two lines and then we'll go across so it's it's kind of following the out the outside line J yeah i mean i don't know i don't know 
we'll put a little bit up this side and then I'm just going to clean the black gel paint off my brush and go in with some white like just the smallest amount of white we'll put a little bit over there and then we'll put a little bit underneath the curvy bit this bit and then I think that's going to do because I have no idea what I'm doing so that's going to go in the lamp for 60 seconds then I'm going to do the same thing on these two nails and then we'll come back to the heart now so look I've done all those they don't need to be top coated again because the Madame Glam gel paints don't have a tacky layer so they're absolutely fine as they are however this one I'm going to take pop the champagne and I'm going to fill that heart in with the pop the champagne gel polish color because this I should have done this before I top coated but I didn't think about it I didn't that's that's my problem I never think oh no I do really I just hadn't yeah I just got ahead of myself <laughs> so yeah so once we've filled that in that will go into our led lamp for 30 seconds and then all we need to do now is take a little bit of that velvet matte top coat and just cover that heart and then pop back the lamps so now that's matte again and then all i'm going to do is like i did on the other nails i'm going to outline everything with the black gel paint so the heart uh, the, if you don't go on the outside of the decal line the decal outline then you you might not have to do this but because it's a cartoon style the black line needed to, to be thicker because just because i don't know why it just did <laughs> so i don't know why have i stopped this bit I, I might have cured that but i don't know maybe i just cut it out because i was doing something and then obviously like we did the other nails we need to go around the outside edge This, this is what takes some time. I'm going to just whiz forward. I'll go around, all, around the edge. And then I'm going to add some of those very fine lines again. We'll do a little bit up there. And then I'm going to go... I, I think this, I, this was too much in the heart. I, I wish I'd not done the line that's quite so long. But yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cure that. But also i'm gonna put a bit of white on like i wish i'd just done a little white line there and then not i wish i'd just left it there just leave it there nats no no and then i just kept going and i was like okay we'll put another bit here i was like you don't need that you don't need that there i mean i mean do you i i don't think i did anyway two more little white lines and then that will go in the lamp and that will be done because i have no idea what i'm doing ah! <laughs> The theme of this set is I just don't know what I'm doing. Um, I do hear though, I'm using some violet. These are violet preciosa crystals and the pink ones are rose. I tried to pitch, pitch, pitch blah, blah, blah. I tried to pick colours that would match the gel polish. So I'm going to use the crystal fix. Oh, by the way, the crystals and the crystal fix are all from Crystal Parade, as is the crystal katana that I'm using here. You can get 5% off using my code NAT5. On the violet nail, the purple nail, I'm going to put the rose crystals. You can't see. This is terrible, terrible, terrible. So I've got one big one and two smaller ones either side like that. And then on the pink one, look, I've put the violet ones on. I'm just going to move the violet ones because that needs rejigging before I pop it in the lamp. But that's them finished. I hope you like them. If you did, please leave me a like. If you haven't already, do consider subscribing. It's completely free and you can always change your mind later, though I'd rather you stayed. Websites and discount codes below. God bless. Love you all. And I will see you in the next one. Love you. Bye.